the common moorhen, scientific name Gallinula chloropus, and the Eurasian coot, scientific name Fulica atra, are both common wading birds found in the British Isles, and they are frequently confused with each other. Identifying adult birds is quite straightforward, while distinguishing juvenile birds can be a bit more challenging. This guide will assist you in confidently identifying between the two species. Coots and moorhens are commonly found in the company of ducks, which might lead to the misconception that they are closely related. However, both species belong to the rail family. They thrive in wetland habitats such as marshes, lakes, and rivers. While coots tend to prefer open water environments, moorhens often choose to inhabit areas with dense vegetation, making them more discreet in their behavior. Coots and moorhens are both aquatic birds that are similar in size, but differ significantly in bulk. Coots can reach a body length of up to 40 centimeters and can weigh as much as 1,000 grams, making them considerably heavier than moorhens which have a maximum body length of 38 centimeters and typically weigh up to 420 grams. Therefore, while their sizes may appear comparable, the coot is noticeably the sturdier of the two. The most distinctive feature on an adult moorhen is the bright red frontal shield and beak. The tip of the beak is yellow. From a distance, their feathers may appear black. However, upon closer inspection, one can observe a dark brown back and a more bluish black belly. Additionally, their flanks feature prominent white stripes, contributing to their unique appearance. When out of the water, moorhens showcase bright yellow feet, reminiscent of chicken feet, accented by vibrant red rings encircling the tops of their legs. Adding to their unique and colorful appearance, juvenile moorhen lack the frontal shield. Juvenile moorhen are predominantly brown in color, as they grow older, they start to develop the white lines down their flanks. The moorhen has diverse vocalizations, producing loud clucks similar to a startled chicken. It also cackles and yelps, often ending calls with what sounds like laughter. Their calls tend to be quieter and more discreet than coots. Adult coots are characterized by their distinctively white or pale pink colored shields and beaks. Their feather coloring is all black. Out of the water, coots are distinguished by their pale gray feet, which feature wide, flat lobes of skin extending along their toes, which act in the same way as webbed feet when swimming. These adaptations not only enhance their swimming abilities, but also allow them to effectively run across the water's surface as they prepare to take flight. Newly hatched coots have a unique appearance. Their heads are adorned with bright orange and red strands, while their bodies are covered in grey, fluffy feathers. This fluffy grey plumage quickly develops into a more uniform grey coat across their bodies, with the exception of whitish patches on their head, neck and breast. Juvenile coots do not have the distinctive frontal shield. The coot is a noisy bird with a wide variety of calls, the most common of which are an alping, which is a harsh croak, and a fit, which is a sharp call, which can sound almost metallic. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you want to see more like this. It really helps the channel.